What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Now, some of y'all already seen this, this live, and if you have, you don't want to watch it again, that's cool. But one thing I love about hot tea, hot, hot chocolate, she liked to go into archives about what's present today. And basically, Hot Tea Hot Chocolate posted a live that Blueface did when he was explaining how he was trying to save <laughs> Krishan and Junior and put them in a house. Okay? So I want to react to it, and I want to react on how I feel today, especially as of Krishan saying that he's trying to, you know, act right. So let's, please, let's get into that. Once again, if you don't want to watch it, you don't have to. If you think we're running out of content, that's so not true. I just want y'all to know it's so much going on on the internet. But I love this type of content, especially the fact that we're putting it together. Because when he get out, the question really is, is he going to Jaden first or Krishan? So those that get it, get it. Those that don't, don't matter to me. Let's get it. I got a whole story for y'all tonight. I don't understand how. Remember, I was, he was whispering in the closet when Jaden was sleeping. Woman keeps like <laughs> trying to make me seem like I didn't try to help her pay her bills prior. I didn't try to help her find a situation. I didn't try to help her plan for this baby. So this is what happened. Like I told y'all, she's been planning to do bad disease. I'm thinking bad disease will happen after the baby's born. She's like, no, they ready to gear up. I'm going to do it while I'm pregnant. I said, oh, man. Yeah. Now, this whole time, I'm not going to lie, he was trying his best to, for one, control the situation. I'm not going to lie, I don't like control, and I hate when men try to control women, so I wasn't on his side at all. Am I on his side today? Not necessarily, but I do see where he was coming from now. Better late than never. Um... He was trying to stop her from just being out here looking kind of crazy. What I don't like is in the process of that, she got to do what he say. I don't like that part of it, but let's listen. You serious? You want to go on a WWE fight show while you're pregnant? Which I did agree with him about that at the time. So I tried to, you know, chop it up with her. Hey, instead of doing that, how about me and you playing a baby shower? We find a spot. We plan for the baby's birth. You know what she say? I need to get on the road and get to this money and that baby shower and all that. Now, I feel like she was saying she need to get on the road and get to this money because at the time, this nigga was basically trying to get her money again. He he like, in order for me to take care of you, I need your bank account information. You know what I'm saying? So... That's wasn't that's that's what wasn't making sense to me. She out here hustling to get money because she need it. Men, stop putting women in a situation where they feel like they got to do something to get some money. That's why y'all can't control women right now because it's like I ain't got no money. I can't even get a burger right now because this nigga, I got to wait on him or whatever. So she going to do whatever she can to make sure she can have a burger, nigga, for later. Sometimes a woman want to stop and get some in and out. I mean, I'm not being funny. <laughs> and when we went, it was about $400 for two people. So a woman to eat for two people. So she need $400 to make sure she can eat her in and out. And if she can't get it, she's going to act out on it. And that's what niggas is not getting. If I feel like I got a struggle, if I feel like I'm already struggling, then what do I need you for? You know what I'm saying? So she's like, I don't need to do none of that. I'm about to go get it. I said, damn. All right, big dog. F it. So she goes on bad disease. You know, I'm paying close attention. I'm watching. She's getting treated like a contestant on the show. And it's really making me mad because I'm like, your baby father is a blue face. You're Krishan Rock. Why are you on a show with like a bunch of, no offense to anybody, but like with a bunch of just... You know, regular people that's trying to brighten their horizon. So I want to speak on that. This is where Krishan be getting that confidence from because he do be in the back of her head like, yo, you Krishan, quit playing. He do the same with Jaden. That's why Jaden's still out here getting them bookings. Where I am lost at, which if y'all pay attention, I'm, com I'm coming to the present, going to the past, coming to the present. Why is it that 
Krishan has to stay in the house. I'm, I'm, I'm really lost on that part. Why does she have to stay in the house? And why is she actually staying in the house? Maybe because her ass is on the run and uh, she ain't trying to get picked up. But now she's broadcasting that she about to be playing football on TV. I cannot make this up. But whatever. She goes on there. It's not what she thinks. Nobody fights for her like she thought. Nobody does what she says on command. So then she hits my phone. Oh, I'm ready to come home. Pastor Mike told me I should come back and I should try it out with you because he's seen all these tattoos. She said her pastor told her to come back and do the right thing with me. And the bitch still didn't listen. She got the word straight from God to the pastor to her. Yo, you should kind of go back and really try harder with Blue, with Blue because you got all these tattoos of him. So it must have been something that led you up to this point. You should see that through. All right. That's what she's telling me. She's telling me, oh, I went to church. So her saying that they decided to work out makes a lot of sense after what he just said, because it's given. Um, he definitely want that family with her. But it's also given that he wants that family with Jade, and I'm not past that. Understand that I'm going from the past to the present. I think that he also, he wants to do it with both of them. You get what I'm saying? And he trying to figure out how to make that work. You know? I just... It's not. It's not going to work. After she not beat the white girl, or had her friends beat the white girl, she told me, oh, I went to church and the pastor told me I should come back to you. I, I want said, damn, so bad. that's what the pastor said. And, uh, all right, shout out the pastor. He knows something. Right? He knows something. Boom. So that's when she leaves Baddie's East. She comes back. I got a whole it family in my house. I told her, look. She comes back. I got a whole family in my house. I will be homeless with you until we find a spot. That nigga don't want Jaden in. I'll be homeless with you until we find a spot means he don't want Jaden. My question is, though, why does he keep going back to her then if that's not the case? And maybe because when Krishan pissed him off, he decides to go back there. Something going on, bro. I think Krishan might be right, though. So I leave my house and I stay in the hotel with her. I'm in the hotel with her, right? So, boom. This is when I got stabbed. So I leave her in the hotel room. Hey, I'm finna go to the gym and work out. You stay here and chill. It was an early morning workout. She tired. I'm like, just chill. Go to the gym. Get a workout in. Boom, I get stabbed. Hit her. Yo, stabbed. I just got crazy. stabbed. We had appointments to see places, penthouses. I wanted her to get a penthouse. Boom. Oh, my God, are you okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I go, instead of going to get stitched up, going to do anything, I go back to the hotel to make sure we make these appointments to see these penthouses. Right? I got a whole gash in my leg. I'm walking, stum stumbling around. I told y'all it was also very smart of him to think of penthouses with her. And I think the reason being is because she's popping way more than Jaden. It will be safer. But she wants to be Blueface. She wants to have a house like Blueface, which is not safe for you. Now I see where he's coming from. However, I don't agree with you can get a house, but you got to have your bank in my name. And then you can't have no niggas at the house. I don't agree with that, y'all. I'm sorry. If we into it and it's my house, I'm going to have whoever I want up in this. I just don't agree with that. I don't. And if if it was honey sauce and it was the other way around, honey sauce should be able to have some niggas up in there if that's what she want to do. Because I'm going to have my own spot anyway. They ain't none of my business, to be honest with you. You know what I'm saying? But when I'm over there, it, it, it's all me. When somebody else over there, ain't none of my business. If that's the agreement we got, I'm just saying. 
I don't like that. But all right. Looking at these penthouses for her and the baby to have some, you know, something. Then I got to go to Atlanta to do this master pass. They got some bread for they got some bread for me. So I'm like, all right, let's go. Take the bitch with me. We get there. It's time for me to go handle this business. I'm telling her, like, yo, I don't want to bring no pregnant girl to this to this social thing. You know, it's going to affect, you know, my program. She instantly make it about her. Oh, I'm not cool enough to come with you. I came with you out here. You mean I need to go with you. What do we win? We are. So Blueface saying that they about to get back together. But that's not going to stop. She's going to go. She's going to want to go everywhere he go, pregnant or not. And then as soon as Krishan, or as soon as he gets to talking crazy about a woman and, you know what I'm saying, he liking her a little better than he liking Krishan, she going to be mad again. It's going to be the same cycle. And that's, I just wish they wouldn't do this. Hey, you know me. I'm out of here. I'm, I just told you what I'm going to do. I'm out of here. Guess what she do? Tit for tat. She lead the room. She at Clark Atlanta University. She over here. She over there. Oh, yeah. That's All when he got jealous about little baby. I'm like, cool. I'm not mad. Rock going to do what she want to do. That's where I got mad at. Later that night, around 12 a.m., we supposed to meet up. I end up going to this restaurant with everybody from the little sh She hit me talking about she got some food for me. So I don't order food at the restaurant. I'm like, my bitch got some food for me. She pull up. I she pull up. I'm like, where the food at? I'm hangry at this point. She said, oh, I threw it out. It was nasty. You know something else I never understand? The food between men and women. Like I'm, I'm hungry, so I need to eat. Uh, and that's what I'm gonna do. You know what I'm saying? When I get to the crib with you, if it's good, I'm gonna eat that too. No cap. You know what I'm saying? Maybe later, but I'm gonna eat that. When I'm hungry, I gotta eat. What about y'all? Huh? Right then and there. So I don't get to try the food? Like, you just gonna... I've been sitting at this restaurant all night waiting for you, thinking you got some food for me. And you get here and you tell them you threw the food away because it was nasty. So I'm instantly heated. Like, that's so selfish. Boom. We get back to the room. I need to smoke. Where the weed? Where the backwoods? Oh, I smoked all the backwoods. I don't know where... The, we don't have... You don't got no food. You don't got no backwoods. You're... Oh, my God. I'm mad. I'm bleeding a Go get me some backwoods right now. <laughs> the bitch leave the room, act like she finna go get me some backwoods, and never comes back. I'm texting her, worried. I like, damn, either. you okay? Is everything all right? If she would have went back, they would have been fighting. Nope. She missed. Mind you, we got an appointment to see a house at 12 p.m. The flight is at 5 a.m. She didn't like none of the penthouses, so I upped it. I said, all right, you don't want to be in a penthouse because you feel like... It's giving apartment vibes. All right. It's crazy. Let's go get a rent a house out. She missed the flight. I get on the flight at 5 a.m. by myself. Haven't heard from her. Then the next day, she had a little baby restaurant leaving taste test reviews. I'm like. Taste test reviews was hilarious. That's what you're doing? Like, you just missed. Okay. From that day forward. I texted my financial advisor, my real estate agent, Jason Lee, and his party promoter. I said, cancel the house, cancel the baby shower. I'm done with her. Her priorities is f And he wasn't wrong. So, he was not wrong at all about that, and her priorities are f up, okay? So, with that being said... If y'all want me to continue to go in the archives, I I will, and I kind of want to, because I want to see when he get out. Like, that really, like, okay, so when I'm off the internet, I don't give a f about none of this sh But when I'm on the internet, <laughs> I want to know, like, when you get out, where you going? And nine times out of ten... He may not be going to Jaden, but he loved them children. The point is, if he go to Jaden first, it's going to be an issue. If he go to Krishan first, it's going to be an issue on both parties. So how do y'all think this is going to go? Let me know down in the comment section below.
Whether you want me to go back into the archives or not, probably still going to do this. Um, yeah. So let me know what y'all thinking down in the comment section below. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah. <laughs>